chips. It's snowing! 2021, get out. I am apparently my neighborhood's creepy old man from Home Alone. It's, I don't know what the day it is, but I know it's gonna be snowing. So I'm excited. Oh, we have a bad dog on our hands. Segment. Oh my God, yes, tell them what you did. What did you do in the night, Segment? I'm still looking at remnants of it. I can't believe Somebody ate a whole that. thing of ground beef. It was sitting on the counter for breakfast this morning for them. Yeah, so I was gonna cook up ground beef that my parents left while they were here, because we don't eat meat. And yeah, I took it out to thaw on the counter. Forgot it. it was gonna put it in the fridge like it was frozen solid. Somebody found it. So we'll see if she gets sick today. All right, so I am back from running my Walmart errands. <laughs> I got some dog food, just some things we needed, and I'm trying to <laughs> take the covers off this, but I can't, so wait for the wifey. Um, I asked yesterday on Instagram for workout video ideas because, you know, I didn't really make it through yesterday's, and I got lots of suggestions, so I found one that looks good, and it's a 30-minute hit workout, so I'm gonna try that right now. I will let you know how it goes. All right. <laughs> you can do the full push-ups, put your knees on the ground like this. Hello everyone, I haven't said hi yet. Hi. It's a snow day. Kinda. Well, I know we told you yesterday that we were supposed to get a snowstorm. I have good faith that it's gonna be a storm. What do you think? I don't believe it till I see it. Yeah, I guess. But I'm hoping. You're hopeful for a storm. Mm -hmm. Also, I did my makeup today. It looks think? nice. Yeah, it looks really good. You did a good job. Thanks. If only I didn't have to wear my Glicos. <laughs> Ew! I called them Glicos with my cousin when we were like... A little child. Little. We made up this language together. That was one of the words. And it stuck. And we still have them. I wish goes. I could show them that video. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm sorry. It's so funny. It's me in my first pair of Glicos saying, oh, it's, I, it is something. If you haven't seen me as a youngster, you're missing You're missing out. out. You are such a hot. I was so cute. Super cute. We're going to go take photos in the snow. Yeah, so. We're going to go back to the park. We're going back to the park with yeah. the babies. I'm gonna go get dressed. I have two outfits ready for yeah. two different photos. Snowing! So snowy. Well, it's just starting to be snowy. I'm already crying off my makeup. Yeah, we'll have to take the photos like soon and then walk. Yeah, cause it's cold and wet, but it's nice. <laughs> Lily found someone's tennis ball and she's been having the best time chasing it. She's like, Mom, throw it again. Throw it again. There's Allie and Elsie. This is actually where I proposed to Allie. Okay, okay, should I kick it? Oh! <laughs> oh, the dogs. The snow's sticking, it's a good sign. are very happy. There's another one back there. Oh, she, she's looking out the back. But it's great. Are you tired, Doodle? Are you tired, Snoopy G? It was really Snoopy cold. Snoopy G says I could keep going. Oh, uh, Snoopy was getting uh, ice in her paws, though. Yeah, but so she kept stopping to chew it out. But she's still happy. Is she a Snoopy. great time? Also, oh, we're laying down. Okay. I can't wait. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh! Hi, cutie patootie. <laughs> it's snowy. 
snowing still, so that's a good sign. Allie is currently planning a vacation to somewhere snowy. No, AKA I'm, just down the nearby, road. Nearby, near. I'm trying to find like a cabin nearby. Lawrence Hill Lodge would be a good to, one to do again. So that's a good option. It's a snow day. It's a snow day. It's a snow day. Yay, let us chips. <sighs> I don't want to walk. I think I'm just gonna order them in. Safety first, you know. Yeah. You don't want to get hurt out walking in a snowstorm. Right. Put of the course. Yule log on after walking. Okay, I'll put the yule log on. So it's snowing. It's our first big dump Ooh. of the winter. Here, this is fully booked. Show you forever. That that beautiful one. Holy moly. So that's a no. This one might be an option. I'm gonna try to show you how much snow has fallen in our yard. Stay tuned. This one's okay, a good one. Let me see here. So that is how much snow has fallen, which really doesn't look like much, but it's probably like an inch, which is a good start. Especially because it's supposed to snow until like noon tomorrow. So our fingers are crossed that we get lots. I love a good snow day. I love, love a good snow day. And I really hope we have a white Christmas, so maybe I hope so too, oh my gosh. I am curled up on, I could curl up right here. Lily had been laying here, so I had to sit on Ferguson's armchair. But I'm gonna bring my blanket over and read my book more. I'm like half done. I know, that was really fast. I'm on a roll. It's good. I love a good thriller that like you're really into, you can't put it down. So it's called The Invisible Girl by Lisa Jules. It's good, I'd recommend it. Lisa Jewel? Lisa Jewel, yeah. It's good. Oh. Allie wants me to put the Yule log on, so I'm gonna do that. But there's not really anything Christmassy to do today, besides like enjoy the snow. That's Christmassy. Yeah, I guess. Did I say we're, we have to order storm chips? So it's a thing here, where every time there's a snowstorm, you have to stock up on storm oh, chips. I'm not gonna get, there won't be storm chips though. I don't like that brand storm chips. Oh really? No. I know. What will we do? Probably but yeah, so it's a do. thing here that you get storm chips whenever there is a snowstorm. I guarantee if we went to a grocery store right now, there would be like no chips. Because everyone gets stocked up on storm chips. Uh, I would really like all dressed chips. Haven't had any in a while. What kind would you like, Allie? Uh, I like salt and vinegar. Salt and vinegar. That is your favorite. Or dill pickle. I don't know. We'll just see what we can find. Yeah. I got gift tags today. That's something Christmassy that happened. They look like this. Oh, they're upside down. They look like this. La 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 la. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna put the Yule log on. Yule log is on, but we definitely need a real fireplace. It'd be so much more cozy. I wish it gave off real heat. What comfortable. Like, <laughs> What a doodle. Hi girls. <laughs> that is very cute. Diddy. Do you love your sister? Oh my goodness. They're so tired from the park. And wow, it's dark, but I was doing a bit of work. I did some photos. Now I'm gonna start my vlog. What's on it? Ooh, a piece of tape. Anyway, I'm excited to keep reading because it's really, really good. How's your book, Al? It's pretty good. I like it. You it's look really cozy. Good. I had two dogs on me, too. Oh, I they're know. eating dinner now, so. And having a little wine. <laughs> it's a good book. I have to tell you something. I finished my book. <laughs> I can't help it. When there's a book that I really like, I just need to, like, get it. Finish. I'm not good at being patient and like slowly enjoying something. I'm like, I need to know how it ends now. So I read the whole book. I enjoyed it. I mean, I'd probably give it, if we're just ranking thrillers, maybe like an eight out of 10, seven out of 10, maybe seven. It was good. I mean, it wasn't that predictable, which is always nice because I feel like a lot of them are very predictable and follow the same storyline. So it was kind of unique. It was good. I liked it. I'd recommend it. So the other night I was watching Home Alone and I told you guys about it. I actually didn't finish it, so I'm not sure how it ends. But you know that creepy guy with his salt bucket? Sho shoveling salt onto the sidewalks? I am apparently my neighborhood's creepy old man from Home Alone. 
because I just spent so much time outside shoveling the sidewalks. <laughs> and I'm so snowy. There's so much snow all like in the back. I'm also, if you wondered what type of Canadian I am, I am the type that goes out mid snowstorm and shovels, even though it's still coming down. I'm, I'm that type of Canadian. But hey, I will thank myself tomorrow when there's not as much heavy snow. Yeah. Unless it blows all night. And then just builds back up anyway. <laughs> we'll see what happens. But Allie and I just went out and got some chips. We went for a walk around the neighborhood. We were supposed to be looking at Christmas lights and stuff, but we kind of didn't. I didn't it really. It was too blowy. It was too blowy, yeah. It was really oh my blowy. God, I have like snow mats in my hair. Why are you mad? Was there a doodle walking by? You don't like him. So we got Ringolos. For those wondering, these are actually gluten free. Sam likes all dressed. And I got these that I've never had them before. Salt and malt vinegar. Mm, what a variety. Yummy. Also, I've decided I'm going to try to do, I'm not sure yet if it's gonna be fully a dry January or if I could do, if I'm gonna do like dry January with like, I'm allowed two drinks in the month in case restaurants open and we wanna go out for a drink or a cocktail or something. But that would be like my limit, I think, is like if we go out two times. So if anyone wants to join me in doing dry minus two January, let me know. And like maybe it'll continue out through, throughout the year because I like setting January goals on this year. Well, that's only a one month goal. Another goal will be get my abs back. That has been on my life list since I was like 12. Every year continues, carried on over, carried over to the next year. 2010, 11, 12, 13, 14 was number one, get abs. I am proud to say I did achieve abs <laughs> in 2020. One thing came out of 2020 was I got abs. I have lost them because spin closed, but obviously it will carry on to my next list, 2021, get abs. We'll see if I can get them back. Um, what else is gonna be on my list? Hmm. Read more. That's on my list every year. Eat healthier. <laughs> That's on my list every year. Walk the dogs more? That's not on my list every year because it was to be single single dog. Now it's two dogs. Um, be more active is always on my list. But I feel like this year I achieved that. I was the most active I've ever been. Like, not. That's a lie. I used to run marathon. Walk one. Many halves. One full. But it was the most active I'd been in a long time. That's going to carry on to this year. Travel is always on my list, but don't know about this year. Anyway, this was pointless. I don't know. I don't know. I got some two pineapples today. Why do you guys are supposed to be good for fertility? <laughs> I, I am actually allergic to pineapples. Got them for the wifey. She does not like pineapples. So no, we just have two pineapples in the kitchen. Maybe the dogs will eat them. No, they won't eat them. You're not gonna eat the pineapples, are you? Doggies don't eat pineapples. All right, well, I'm gonna continue my book now. Hey, Allie. I thought you wanted to wear these sexy PJs tonight. I did, but it's, it's so too cold. It's freaking cold instead. <laughs> Cozy lady. <laughs> Look at my slips. I see them, they're good slips. I got them from McDonald's. Yeah, McDonald's sent us a gift I'm package so cold. today. Was I know. Oh, your hands are so cold. Get them out of my shirt. <laughs> so, Allie and I made a bet earlier on our walk. Oh, do you want to tell them about the bet? What is it? So, we made a bet that tomorrow, I think the schools are going to be closed. Oh, that was amazing. Allie thinks the schools are going to be open. So, we made a bet that whoever's right doesn't have to take the dogs out once all day. <laughs> I'm gonna be ready. So, are you gonna read your book? Yeah. I thought you were going to start it forever ago and you've just been like lollygagging. I was 
eating my ringolos while I watch the snowfall. Mm. The snow's coming down! So I'm gonna start reading, but I usually fall asleep, so I, I have to take my eyes out. Mm. And then start reading, and I, I just, like, fall asleep while I read. Mm. You know? Yeah. Shall we sleep with the windows open tonight? Uh, no, it is freezing cold and no. snowing. Oh. Snow would come in through the windows. Why? I meant the blind. Oh. <laughs> oh. So, you know how I always say that I absolutely hate how it gets dark so early in the winter here? I completely forgot that when it is snowy, it is actually so bright. Yeah, it's nice. It is so bright like, out right now. not actually bright in the sky. It's just bright because of the light. But no, like, look, the sky is, like, definitely lighter. Yeah. It's like, it's like a it's light It's the reflection. Blue. Yeah. And the snow reflects so much light. Hi, Doody. Come here. No meat eating tonight. <laughs> I look like a chin, chinny. I know who did that. Chinchilla? <laughs> That's not Chad I did once. What was that? Chinchilla. I had like, I'm like this. I did so many chins. And from beneath and a bit chinchilla. But yeah, Hopefully I'm gonna wash my face, take my eyeballs out. I got new contact solution today. <laughs> Woo -woo. Good job. So fun. Actually, it is exciting news because I needed some. Nothing like a dry eye. So I finished my book, like I said. So Don't now spoil. I need to find something else to read. I'm thinking I'm gonna read some Harry Potter fan fiction. And I know none While of you are right. surprised. Yeah, until I can read the next book, because Allie is a slow reader. No! I am a fast Why? Well, I'm like fast as normal people. You're just weird. Did you take my phone charger downstairs? Yeah. You have to go down and get it. Uh, what? Yes, my phone only has 1%. You what? need to go get my charger. Does anyone else's spouse always steal I actually never do, but... Charger? Yes, you do. No. Also... It now seems like a great time to tell you about this old thingy majiggy I got. So I got the Mira Fertility Tracker back when we were doing IUIs. And, well, I got it because we planned on doing more IUIs. And honestly, I get so, so stressed. Che like, checking ovulation. I'm always terrified I'm going to miss, like, the LH peak. So how you test ovulation typically is by, like, peeing on a stick and comparing two lines and if the one line gets as dark as the other line then it's a positive but sometimes you could miss your peak and then you miss your window because it's actually kind of hard to get pregnant sometimes <laughs> you have to time it just right especially when it comes to doing an IUI like it needs to be perfectly timed because the egg only lives for so they long teach you that. I, I uh, well no because they don't want to encourage Oh. Like, because you could technically get pregnant at a different time. You, you could release late. You could... I guess. I got a Mira tracker. It's called, so it looks like this. It's a little kind of computer guy. It has just a little, like, ovulation tracking app. So it measures two different hormones, not just LH, like the typical pee on a stick. They're called OPKs, ovulation predictor, predictor kits. Um, do, so they only test LH. This tests both estradiol which is a form of estrogen, and uh, LH. So it's supposed to be more, um, like, accurate. It's supposed to be more accurate. I couldn't think of the word accurate. And then it gives you the actual number, of, like, the actual amount of LH and estradiol you have, which is nice because you're not just looking at two lines and being like, oh, I wonder. It's good. So, I'm, yeah, I'm giving it a try. I'll let you know what I think once I've tried it more. This is my, obviously, first cycle using it because I just got it. So, there we go. Okay, we're going to go to sleep. Good night. Good night. We'll see you in the morning. So many days of vlogmas. Just keeps coming. Oh. Hopefully you're liking it. And thank you to everyone that's tuning in because you're great. And thank you. I can't believe you watch every day. I know. It blows my mind. <laughs> Okay, sweet dreams. Mm -hmm.